Today on Cabela's Deer Gear TV, we'll check out the newest offering from Yamaha, the 2016 Grizzly ATV. We'll take an in-depth look at one of 10 Point's top-of-the-line crossbows. And later, we'll learn about two of Thompson Center's top rifles, the TC Compass and the TC Strike. All this and much more coming up on Cabela's Deer Gear TV. You know, I spend a lot of time in some pretty tight conditions and some pretty rugged terrain, and I'm demanding a lot from my equipment when I do so. I've got to get into these areas. I've got to haul a lot of gear in, whether it's camera gear, hunting gear, backpacks. And once I get there, if I'm successful, I need to be able to haul out my game. And the all new for 2016 Grizzly ATV that I was field testing ensured that I was going to be able to combine superior handling, comfort and performance in a machine that was built for exploring like I was doing hunting in the off-road. And for you guys that like recreational riding, it's going to provide that for you. The all-new 2016 Grizzly ATV combines superior handling, comfort and performance in a machine purpose-built for exploring, hunting and recreational riding. From front to back, top to bottom, the assembled in USA 2016 Grizzly is designed to be the most comfortable, off-road capable and durable big bore ATV for hunters traversing any trail or technical terrain. From the aggressive new styling and chassis featuring an all new handlebar mounted work light, new 26 inch tires and new suspension, to Yamaha's proven ultramatic fully automatic transmission and on-command four wheel drive system, the all new Grizzly is the outdoorsman's premier choice of ATV. The all-new Grizzly, it's always been the choice for ATV riders and hunters, guys that demand the most from it, and now it's even better. Stop by your dealer, find out a little bit more, or for more information right now, go to the website and learn more about Yamaha's Grizzly. It's what you're going to want to take into the backwoods. Before you can take your Yamaha Grizzly out to that big buck, you've got to know where you're heading. And when you're out tracking a harvest, one of the best tools to have nearby is a Garmin handheld GPS. You know, the, the ability to have mapping uh, has, has come so far uh, to people today, you know, wearing it on your watch, having it on your phone, having it in your hand. Uh, it's amazing the technology advances that are out there. And it's something that in a, in a deer tracking scenario that is, is invaluable. You know, it's, everybody's going to mark a stand that's using some of these and be able to understand where they're at, how to get to and from a location. But being able to use it uh, and take it a step further, you know, analyzing the topography, understanding sunrise and sunset and all that data that you can put in there. But after a shot is taking, being able to mark blood trails, being able to mark the last blood, you know, and go right back to it, but being able to analyze that data on places that you've looked, and it's, it's every hunter's nightmare to take a shot and the blood ends, and you mark it. And then you go into that grid search that you hear about where four or five of your buddies are cutting back and forth. Well, if you'll use a handheld GPS, you can eliminate some of the areas uh, and know that you covered them. Know that, hey, we got that quadrant, but oh my goodness, we missed this whole 200, 300 yard stretch right here. And it will tell you where some of those things are. So as you look at this little set of black lines right here, this is actually a track for a deer that was uh, shot at in the evening. We, we took the shot way up here and you can see the lines that go there. That's the actual blood trail. And that 003 number is where I threw a waypoint where we lost, uh, lost blood about midnight on that particular deer right there. As you zoom in and kind of scroll around, you can see all of the tracking as we tried to find more blood. We're, we're dialed in to 120 feet of the, of the spot right there, and you can see all the lines. And you know, and that's just me uh, looking around. There's three other people out here. Now, when you look at this and further analyze it, you know, this, this direction here, I never looked for blood. And then when you go back up here, I never looked for blood. So as you break that down that night after you go back and you're getting ready to track the next morning, you can begin to expand your searches to those areas of unknown, because this is a known. We didn't find the blood right there. Let's look in some of the areas of unknown and see what uh, what we might be able to find. Now coming out of that type of a track at nighttime, would we have been able to figure that out where we, you know, looked and where we didn't? Possibly, but I guarantee you with a handheld like this, whether it's on your watch or right here, we were able to know exactly the areas that we missed. Deer Gear TV is brought to you by Cabela's. It's in your nature. Yamaha ATV, 
Real World Tough. Thompson Center, America's master gun maker. Do All Outdoors. Bradley Smoker, food smoking made easy. We'll be right back. Introducing the newest member of the Yamaha off-road family. It thrives in the most remote, rugged terrain. It never steps down from a challenge and travels long distances in search of adventure. The all-new Yamaha Wolverine. It's a whole new animal. It's in our stomping grounds and our playground. It's in our sights and our commitment. It's in him, it was in them, and it will continue with her. It's in my nature. Is it in yours? What I love about the Bradley Smoker is that it cooks everything perfectly and it holds all the juices in. So today we are going to be smoking some barbecue ribs, some venison sausage, and some dove, which is awesome. You will never grill me doves again. <laughs> I have to have them in the Bradley Smoker. I would prefer to use the Bradley Smoker every time I cook. Well, that's really true because I love this thing. Okay. No lie. For more recipes, log on to bradleysmoker.com. Perfection is an experience. You know it when you feel it. At 10 Point, we build perfect moments into every crossbow. All you have to do is seize them. 10 Point, perfection lives here. The thing about public land is that most people hunt the same old beaten path. The thing about you is, you're not most folks. Introducing the new TC Compass, only by Thompson Center. Follow your own compass with America's master gun maker. My secret weapon? Abercom. It's the first ever calming scent. It's real smells from bedding areas. To deer, that means safety. Evercom reassures even nervous deer. Which can help you get the shot. I use Evercom all season long. Put it on your boots, your pants, and your decoy. It's stick form, won't wash away or freeze. Evercom. 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 From the family deer farm at Conquest Scents. Welcome back to Deer Gear TV. Do All Outdoors offers a wide variety of tools to help make your hunt go as smoothly as possible. Among their innovations is a great lineup of ground augers that are a must for any ground blind hunting situation. Let's join Wade out in the field for a few tips on making the most of your ground blind with Do All Outdoors. You know, hunting to me is something I'm thinking about 12 months out of the year. And so when I'm planning a lot of the different stands or pop-up locations that we're going to be hunting, I'm thinking about future deer activity and future deer movement. This particular location right here is a large food plot that we've got. And I know that the deer primarily are bedding back in this direction right here. Well, the prevailing wind for this location is normally blowing this way about 10 months out of the year. However, when we start getting into that pre-rut, rut, and post-rut, we start having some big cold fronts in this area where the wind's gonna be coming dead in my face right here. So this isn't a stand that we built this early in the year with plans of hunting right now. It's one that we plan on using much later in the year. We know from past history, a lot of deer work the edge of this field. They're making scrapes, they're heading out in the field in the late evening and then 
as the sun comes up, they come back the same way to go to their bedding area back over here. So we've built this pop-up with plans for future hunts. We may only have an opportunity to hunt this blind once or twice a year, but in those times when the wind is blowing right into those windows and going out that way, it's gonna be a prime location for hopefully a big buck or maybe somebody's first doe. So when I look at, at setting up pop-ups, I'm always looking at the different shooting you know, angles and stuff here. And I've really got three different shooting lanes here that we're gonna clear out. And, and be thinking about the distances you know, that some of your arrows are gonna take off out of your bow to make sure you clean the canopy up in the right way. But never cut so much brush that you're gonna be able to get picked off when it comes time to move. I actually took down a little Sinisa bush here that I'm using on the blind now. And you know, this blind that we've got right here, I really like its design because it's got all these little loops around it right here where I can go in and brush it up. Now granted, I know I'm probably not hunting once again for some time here, but I like the way it looks now and I can come in and brush it up again as I get closer to it. I also spend a lot of time kind of making some 3D looks to it. I'll find old dead brush and put it out here and just create that illusion of darkness in there many times. So when you start clearing out your shooting lanes, get in here, pay attention to where you think your best shots are gonna be, but never ever clean so much that you, you're gonna get picked off when it comes time to draw. You know, anchoring down a pop-up to me is one of the most important things. You know, you're gonna have some storms that are gonna come in, you're gonna have some, some bad weather, and you know, really being able to secure all the different lines off to the side to where they can act basically work against each other to keep this thing in, in good position in those high windy days is really key. The other thing is anchoring down the bottom all the way around. You know, a lot of people will only put one or two down you're just asking for trouble there when you're gone, when the wind gets in, can get underneath it. I always make sure and go each corner in the middle when I have those opportunities to really secure it down. The other thing you can do is push a lot of this stuff up underneath there in different positions to help, you know, kind of keep some of the different varmints from getting up uh, inside your blind. And then finally, Pay attention to where you plan on sitting in your blind. You know, get in there with your bow or your rifle or whatever and practice raising and lowering, making sure you're clearing everything, making sure there's nothing in the way. And it will definitely help you be better prepared when it comes time for that moment of truth when you're hunting in a pop-up. All right, we've just about got this blind really set up exactly how we want it. I'm gonna grab my bow in just a minute and actually practice drawing in here and making sure I'm clearing top to bottom, got my quiet chair in here from Cabela's. I wanna make sure when I wrap this whole thing up that I'm ready to go so that the next time I come to this stand, I'll be here for business. And one final thing when I'm getting ready to leave this area, I always want to make sure and pull everything down that's gonna be behind me. I'm not gonna be looking back behind me during this hunt right here, so I want to get as much darkness behind me as I can. So when I'm drawing, or when I'm raising that gun, raising that muzzleloader, rifle, whatever it may be, nothing's gonna pick off that movement. It's gonna give me more time to make the shot that I'm looking for. We'll be right back. Stealth Cam. Trail cameras with features you demand. With the durability and performance you can count on. Built to withstand even the harshest conditions. Stealth Cam. Join the Trail Cam Revolution. Put the cool in life. We put the cool in coolers. Arctic ice. Yeah. 
I've never shot a multicolored pig like that. That is just awesome. First pig with the crossbow. I am pumped and excited. If you enjoy the outdoors, you're gonna wanna have a Bubba Blade by your side. Introducing the Bubba Blade Rhino, AKA the stubby skinning knife. Well, on this pig today, the, I used the Bubba Blade stubby. I mean, that thing worked phenomenally. We've shortened up the handle to four inches and put a razor sharp four inch skinning blade on it to make the perfect skinning and gutting knife. You'll be able to work close in with ease. Like all Bubba Blades, the knife features our patented handle that gets sticky when wet so it won't slip out of your hand while you're working. Combined with our razor sharp skinning blade, you have one kick ass knife. Go online at BubbaBlade.com to order your Bubba Blade today. For over 15 years, the Titan Crossbow has reigned as the top-selling 10-point model. Redesigned for improved handling and better performance, the Titan SS is the next generation in the legendary family tree. The affordably priced Titan SS features the Fusion S stock, configured with optimal comb height and an adjustable butt plate that adjusts to one of two fixed positions for perfect length of pull. The Fusion S stock uses strategically placed cutouts in the foregrip and buttstock to reduce weight and improve handling and balance. Focused on safety, the cutouts in the foregrip also encourage shooters to wrap their thumb and fingers through the foregrip and keep them safely below the flight deck. In addition, the foregrip is backed up with glass reinforced nylon safety wings fitted on the stock above the grip. The crossbow's 175 pound bow assembly measures 18 and a half inches when cocked, making it highly maneuverable in the woods. Its fully machined aluminum riser features two large weight reduction cutouts, and its 13 inch HL limbs are powered by XR wheels and D97 string and cables. Assembled, the Titan SS measures 35 inches long, weighs in at a mere 6.7 pounds, and shoots up to 340 feet per second. The Titan SS also comes standard with 10 points 3 power ProView 2 scope. And like all 10 point crossbows, it features our DFI, dry fire inhibitor, and 3.5 pound auto engaging safety trigger. The model is available with or without one of 10 points 2 patented cocking units, the AccuDraw or AccuDraw 50, and is sold as a complete package, which includes the scope, quiver, and arrows. It's pre-sighted at the factory and ready for the woods. After harvesting a huge buck with a 10-point crossbow, you'll be rewarded with a cooler full of meat and an appetite to go with it. Let's head back to deer camp now to get a few ideas for dinner using the Bradley smoker. Now that I got the jalapenos in the smoker, I'm gonna make some venison, smoked bacon wrap, cream cheese. We have venison backstrap, jalapeno flavored cream cheese, some sliced jalapenos, and these are fresh from our garden, and then bacon, and we're gonna wrap it all together. We'll get to see their reaction, if they like it or not, and I have a feeling they're gonna like it. I take my knife here, and I cube the back strap, and I like to season mine, again, with Cajun seasonings before I even wrap it. So you take your pick on any kind of spices that you like. There we go. Then I'm going to take a piece of bacon, just like this. And then grab your cube back strap. Take a wallop of jalapeno flavored cream cheese. Get a nice little jalapeno in there, smush it in there. And then wrap it like this. And you sort of want to wrap it all the way around to keep all the juices inside and the cheese from melting out. Just like that. Voila. Okay, now we're gonna put it in the smoker. Right on top of our jalapeno poppers. We're gonna come back in about an hour and a half and do the taste test. Okay, it's been about an hour and a half. We're gonna pull out our bacon wrap jalapenos and make sure they're ready first. I'm pretty sure they're pretty good to go. There we go. Yep, they look good to me. 
I think the guys are gonna love this. Now let's get our um, back strap, bacon wrap, jalapeno poppers. They look pretty good too. You be the judge. <laughs> We're gonna let these cool for about 10 minutes and let the guys do a taste test. What I love most about the Bradley Smoker is I can prepare this in less than like 10 minutes, turn the smoker on, put it in there for about an hour and a half in our Bradley smoker, and it nothing's gonna dry out. It's, it's gonna be juicy, it holds in all the juice and the flavors of the meat. It's, it's wonderful, it tastes great. Uh, we love our Bradley smoker, we use it all the time. All right, guys, I need a taste test. Please, please. Who's, who's please, please. <laughs> please. And be honest. Hot. Well, we let it cool for about 10 minutes, so you let me know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you approve? It's Hunter Why? approved? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Comfortable to carry, comfortable to shoot. It's slim, concealable, and powerful protection. The M&P Shield by Smith & Wesson. Confidence? We perfected that years ago. Ingalls got the original high-performance cooler and a whole lot more. Ingle coolers go with the original. Heavy duty, rugged, and designed for the big game hunter and angler. The Food Saver Game Saver Titanium Vacuum Sealer has the power and performance to seal in the freshness of your game and fish for up to three years, five times longer than standard storage methods. And with its extra wide dual and repetitive sealing capabilities, that's a ton of big game savings. Tough tested and rated 4.8 out of five stars by outdoorsmen just like you. The Food Saver Titanium System, it's a true game changer. High Viz Shooting Systems knows that your shooting performance matters in all conditions. All High Viz shooters experience faster target acquisition with our durable light wave sights. Featuring easily interchangeable light pipes, light wave sights give your eyes the exact sight picture you crave. Shoot High Viz. See what you've been missing. Nikon's no-fault policy was created for those who continually push the envelope, travel the farthest, stay the longest, brave the most hostile elements. We do our best to deliver on our promise of a lifetime of performance. And we'll stand with you should accidents happen. Trust earned. Nikon. Every day, your eyes are exposed to dust, debris, and wind. Only Wiley X removable gaskets block it all out, and your eyes remain safe. Wiley X, absolute premium protection for sportsmen. Deer Gear TV is brought to you by Smith & Wesson, made in the U.S. since 1852. Garmin. Hi Viz. See what you've been missing. Wiley X, absolute premium protection. And 10-point crossbows. There is no substitute.
When it comes to gun selection, there are a lot of options out there for hunters. Hunt conditions, target animals, and personal preference all come into play. Luckily, Thompson Center has you covered no matter what your hunt demands. Let's take a look at two of their state-of-the-art products, the TC Compass and the TC Strike. One of the funnest things about my job is getting to see new products, getting to field test new products, getting to spend a lot of time with them. And I spent a tremendous amount of time talking about them before they ever hit the market. And one thing that I'm pretty excited about heading into deer season is Thompson Center's newest rifle. And I'm gonna introduce you today to the TC Compass, a great choice of rifle with a price point that's below $400 to match any budget. The TC Compass was built to offer you an accurate but affordable firearm that's gonna give you three shot groups at one inch with premium ammunition right out of the box. Some of the great features include an adjustable trigger that you personally can adjust so that you can set the weight to pull between three and a half and five pounds with a minimum over travel. The TC Compass also features a threaded muzzle. This threaded muzzle allows you to be able to use compatible compensators, muzzle brakes, and suppressors. The TC Compass also has a three lug bolt design that is so simple yet rugged design that it lends itself to years of reliable service that's going to help ensure top-notch accuracy and reliability. One of my favorite features is the three position safety. This provides a visible and tactile feedback as to the position of safety. And this is a great safety feature for everyone because it provides a lock, load, unload, and fire position. So you're automatically going to know exactly where you're at every time with the TC Company. Another great feature is maximum scope clearance. The 60 degree bolt lift provided by the three lug design ensures that the shooter has maximum clearance between the bolt handle and the mounted scope for fast cycling for follow up shots if needed. But with the accuracy of the compass, I don't think they're going to need it unless you got buck fever really bad. Another cool thing I noticed right out of the box was the flush fit rotary magazine. This detachable compact rotary magazine fits flush with the stock for easy carrying and basically no snags when you're in the field. The low maintenance rust proof polymer magazine provides for smooth feeding and a durable packing. The magazine comes in a five round capacity in the standard calibers and four rounds for those big bore magnums out there. The TC Compass, designed to deliver today's sports shooters and hunters a feature rich bolt action rifle at an affordable price point. The TC Compass, American made craftsmanship and value, built into a professional grade rifle. Look for it this season. We'll be carrying it come deer time. If a muzzle loader is more of your style, Thompson Center has another great option in the TC Strike. The new Strike really brings in several different attributes that allow uh, even better success because they're easier to use, easier to clean, and easier to maintain. The new Thompson Center Strike is a model of muzzle loaders that when I first took it out of the box, I was really drawn to. Uh, it's got some features that are very unique to it that are gonna basically allow uh, hunters that are picking up a muzzleloader for the first time to be, uh, almost feel like they're seasoned veterans. The TC Strike offers today's shooters and hunters innovative and useful features such as an Armor Knight corrosion protected metal finish on the outside and inside the barrel. Not only does this increase accuracy, but it also extends the life of your rifle. The TC Strike also comes with a stealth striker, an ambidextrous cocking system that eliminates scope clearance issues and is whisper quiet. The TC Strike comes standard with a 209 primer ignition, and by using the Adapt Breach System, you have the ability to change out your primer adapter to different configurations to optimize performance with your choice of projectile. The Thompson Center Strike gives you basically three different models out there to choose from, whether you're looking for that classic wood grain stock or a synthetic stock, which is my favorite, or one that is uh, basically camouflaged. So you're going to be able to find one that fits your eye and your style. Uh, it's a very compact a muzzle loader that's easy to use, so when you take it out of the box, it's probably not going to be minutes until you're ready to take it to the field and start shooting it and getting it dialed in for your next hunt. All TC Strikes are proudly made in the U.S., and you can learn more at tcarms.com. Like what you see on Deer Gear? Win products and gift cards simply by liking us on Facebook at Deer Gear TV. You'll get up-to-date info on all our featured gear and the inside scoop on upcoming giveaways. Just visit facebook.com slash deergeartv. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.